Okay, kids, welcome back to the shop. Today we're working on a 2002 Kawasaki KX65 carburetor. It is a Makuni carb. The customer stated, after sitting for a while, gas started com coming out of the overflow. We know what the problem is. Typical problem, it's been sitting too long. The gas varnishes up, everything inside sticks, and it overflows. Perfect. This is an easy fix. We clean the carburetor. We're good to go. Unfortunately, the customer decided to attempt to clean it themselves. They decided that they should adjust the floats. Listen up, kids. Never, ever, ever adjust the floats. If the bike ran good when you parked it, and then you let it sit for a while, and you put gas in it, and gas came out the overflow, that means this is all gummed up. The floats didn't get out of adjustment mysteriously by just sitting. Don't fiddle with shit. Just clean the carburetor. Now, the best way to clean this is we're going to boil it in lemon juice. That's exactly the way to clean it. Lemon juice is acid. We're going to boil it. So, okay, kids, let's tear this thing apart. All right, let's see what we got. Guessing it should be clean if they cleaned it. Nah, it's not clean. All right, guys, so look in here. Can you see this? See there's rust in here? You got to get all that out. If you're going to clean it, you have to get that out. This thing stinks. Man, does it stink. This doesn't even smell like gas. Time to remove the innards of this carburetor. Before you start this process, get a parts diagram and study it. You need to know what you're in for. There are O-rings, tiny springs, and little flat washers behind some of these jets. couldn't find my cauldron, so I had to use this shallow pan. I like to use straight lemon juice, but I had to dilute it because I didn't have enough juice. Boil for about 30 minutes or until clean. The cleaning went very well. Everything looks really good. Let's start putting everything together. Let's identify some parts here. So this is the um, float valve right here. This is the uh, the needle jet and then on top here this is the main jet they call this the plunger everyone calls that the choke that goes in there this is the pilot air screw this is the throttle stop this goes in here and it stops the uh, the slide so a lot of people call this the idle Time to install the float. Take your time here. This is a critical process. Before installing the bowl, flip the carburetor over and check that the floats aren't sticking. I did not readjust the floats. Apply a lightweight lubricant to everything. I forgot to install the jet needle holder. Cleaning is done. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.